Okay, so we spoke yesterday about um, how your gut instinct quite often tells you something. So it quite often it's like that emotional trigger. So it's it can be like feelings of danger, feelings of um, not feeling safe. Sometimes it's feelings of alleviation because you know you've got out of a situation. So what we're now going to discuss is what it feels like, right? So I've written a kind of list of things that I've experienced in the past. So I put butterflies, you know, that, that kind of feeling that you've got loads of butterflies in your stomach, that st stomach churning, you know, you're like, oh my gosh, like I just, you know, something's going on and I don't really know what. Sometimes it's tension in your stomach. Sometimes I, I talk quite a lot um, to my clients about that heavy weight in your stomach that you just cannot shift. Um, as an aside, sometimes people experience that for quite a prolonged period of time, which would maybe indicate that you're constantly having to rely on your gut because you're constantly feeling in danger or distressed. Um, that's, I guess, another topic, but something to be quite mindful of if you are feeling like that all the time, just kind of work out maybe why you're, you're feeling like that. Um, other kind of experiences would be feeling sick, you know, feeling um, just really uncomfortable, feeling quite nauseous you know, that tightness in your stomach, as if there's like a knot there. And then also sometimes um, that feeling of lightness, quite often that is um, when you're maybe out of a situation, you've just got that feeling of alleviation. So I'm trying not to be prescriptive here because um, gut instincts and gut sensations can feel so differently for so many different people. It can be associated with um, sort of panic attacks, distress, um, anxiety, depression, trauma. It can also um, sort of be linked to sort of just in the moments where you are with someone and you just don't feel safe. So it can be a number of different reasons. So I guess the task that I'm going to set for everyone who is listening to this video is try and refine it, pay attention to it, so if your stomach is starting to grumble and obviously, you know, it could, it could be hunger, it could be that you've eaten something that doesn't agree with you, it could be some sort of unknown intolerance, right? But irrespective, if you have, you know, if your stomach's turning away and you don't know what's going on, tune into it, find out the source and work out why you feel the way you feel. And to do that, we will cover that in tomorrow's session. Okay, thanks. <laughs>